Hello grade 6 learners. Welcome back to our mathematics class. For today's lesson, we will solve word problems involving electric consumption. Before solving word problems, let us first have a quick review on the following concepts. So focus muna tayo sa pinakataas na row. Makikita natin na unknown or nawawala ang electric consumption. Ang formula sa pagkuha ng electric consumption ay present reading minus previous reading. Ang ating present reading ay 2,651 kilowatt hour. At ang previous reading naman ay 1,833 kilowatt hour. Ipag-subtract natin ang dalawa. 1 minus 3 cannot be. Borrow 1 from 5. 5 becomes 4 and 1 becomes 11. 11 minus 3 is 8. 4 minus 3 is equal to 1. 6 minus 8 cannot be. Borrow 1 from 2. 2 becomes 1 and 6 becomes 16. 16 minus 8 is equal to 8. 1 minus 1 equals 0. So our electric consumption is 818 kilowatt hour. Sa susunod na example naman ay nawawala ang previous reading. Ang formula naman sa pagkuha ng previous reading ay present reading minus electric consumption. Ang ating present reading ay 2,566 kilowatt hour. At ang ating electric consumption naman ay 54 kilowatt hour. Ipag-subtract natin sila. 6 minus 4 is 2. 6 minus 5 is 1. Bring down 5. Bring down 2. Ang ating previous reading ay 2,512 kilowatt hour. Sa pangatlong example naman ay unknown ang present reading. Ang formula sa pagkuha ng present reading ay previous reading plus electric consumption. Ang ating previous reading ay 1,738 kilowatt hour. At ang ating electric consumption ay 121 kilowatt hour. Ipag-add natin sila. 8 plus 1 is 9. 3 plus 2 is 5. 7 plus 1 is 8. Bring down 1. Ang ating present reading ay 1,859 kilowatt hour. Subukan naman natin ngayon ang word problem na ito. The electric meter reading on May 7th was 3,657 kilowatt hour and on June 7th, it was 3,823 kilowatt hour. How many kilowatts of electricity did the family use in one month? Sa so May 7th, Ang electric meter reading ay 3,657 kilowatt hour. Yun ang ating previous reading. Sa June 7 naman, ang electric meter reading ay 3,823 kilowatt hour. Yun ang ating present reading. Ang hinahanap natin ay electric consumption. Ang formula na gagamitin natin ay present reading minus previous reading. Subukan mo siyang gawin ngayon. Post mo muna itong video. Tapos kapag may sagot ka na, saka mo ay resume. Tignan mo kung tama ka. Sige na, mag-solve ka na. Huwag laging ako. Nasasanay ka na kasi eh. Timer starts now. Times up. Ang tamang sagot ay 166 kilowatt hour. Shout out po sa mga nag-solve. Congratulations sa inyo. Sa mga hindi naman nag-solve. Ewan ko. No comments na lang. Tandaan ninyo. 
Ang present reading ay para sa kasalukuyang buwan at ang previous reading naman ay yung reading noong nakaraang buwan. Halimbawa, sa buwan ng April, ang present reading ay yung reading sa April at ang previous reading ay yung reading noong March. Pagdating naman ng May, yung reading sa May ang magiging present reading at ang previous reading niya ay yung reading noong April. Pagdating naman ng June, yung reading sa June ang magiging present reading at ang previous reading niya ay yung reading noong May. Ganun yun. Muli, maraming salamat sa panunood. Hanggang sa muli, have a nice day. God bless.